Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Excuse this, okay? This is like my cell phone holder and Lord knows if I take it out, I won't be able to put it back in. So we, we're gonna pretend like this is not here, but we have another car video. So I'm sitting like almost in the middle, but I'm good. Um, I like making these car videos because I feel like they're more conversational in format, um, unedited, and we're just having a conversation. So um, I got a really great question. Someone asked me about um, why did we have a $3 million retirement number uh, and do we plan on moving out of the country, you know, once you retire? So I thought, oh my goodness, this would be a great opportunity for me to talk about that. So our retirement number is big. Now you do not need the number that we have. You can probably retire on much less. It's just our situation is, you know, a little bit, I would say unique in a sense. So number one, I'm 40 years old. So the plan, Lord willing, is to retire from the day job in about two years or so. So at 42, still, especially according to the government, um, according to many of you guys in my comments, family members, we're still very young, okay? Um, and, you know, we realize is that when we do back away from, I would say, a stable, reliable income, we still have bills. Uh, rent or mortgage. I mean, we have mortgages, but I mean, at the end of the day, if the tenants don't pay, we still have to pay, you know, the mortgage, which we do. Um, we still have kids. So my two youngest boys, one is 12, one is 14, um, they still need to be provided for. I do have an 18 year old, but and even then she may need some assistance. Um, you know, it's just really thinking about, you know, what will life look like, how we want our lives to look when we do back away from the day job. Now, one of the biggest plans my husband and I have is to really focus on building up our own side hustles or side businesses. So like MT, Mommy Trader, I would love to go at this full time, scale the channel. I don't advertise the channel at all. Um, it just grows kind of naturally, organically. And oh, shout out to 25,000 subscribers. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much for 25,000 subscribers. I do appreciate it. Like, y'all are some real ones. I do appreciate you being here. Just, you know, a regular mama, wife. I'm filming videos in my car, right? Um, but just, you know, trying to do all that we can with consistency to get to our goals, right? And so, um, you know, really trying to, my husband and I would like to build up our own side businesses, but that takes time and it takes money, right? Because if the business takes a long time to get off the ground, again, we still got to pay the mortgage. We need to eat gas or need is needed for the car. Um, so that factors into that number. Um, another reason why we need such a high number is because we don't plan on moving from where we are. Now, I know there are a ton of early retirees or retirees who move abroad. And I think that's pretty cool, actually. Um, but for us, that is not in our strategy. So in our retirement number, inflation and just the cost of living is built in. Is it like, is that what we want to do? No, but we're controlling the controllables. That is something that um, uh, a military commenter left. I have a lot of military people that follow my page. Shout out to all of you. My dad, who this week made one year since he's been gone. He passed away last November and he was a Marine. He was a diehard Marine, so military kid. And, um, you know, he was big into, you know, routine and structure. And, and um, so just shout out to all of my veterans who served in the past, who's serving now. Shout out to all of you. But, um, you know, we just don't plan on moving abroad because number one, our families are here. So my husband and I have big families. He has a, a really big family. And so like, I'm talking gatherings, like sitting on the floor because there's nowhere else to sit, like wall to wall people. That's how our Thanksgivings are. You know, like it's it's busy, um, barbecues, things like that. So we have our families here. My church is here. I have an autistic son who, you know, has his supports here, his therapists, his teachers. Um, those are important things that mean a lot to my husband and I. And I know that we cannot get that anywhere. And so, you know, staying where he can have his supports is so, so, so important. That, and not just that, like my husband's favorite barber is here. Now, if you know anything about men getting a haircut, 
that's a very big thing my husband's barber is here but my favorite restaurants my, my neighbors are great um i have like four different back ways to get home from any given location which is amazing like i we go to florida probably about once a year florida does not have any back roads if you are in orlando and you are on i4 you are stuck on i4 but where i live i know four different ways to get home so you know those are all things that mean a lot to us that factors into our retirement number um and so you know <laughs> could we retire with less probably um but i feel like and my husband feels the same way like we have sacrificed and put in so much work and to get to where we are that when we retire we want to just like live the way we want. Now I'm not talking about like balling out and, and all of this, but I'm saying like, if we want to go out to a nice restaurant, if we want to go to New York and see a play on Broadway, if we want to, you know, make a big donation to an organization or to a charity or to a church, I want to be able to do that without, you know, like, like worried about, you know, do I have enough money? And, and another thing is that in, you know, we're not factoring in Social Security at all. Uh, I know a lot of people who are able to retire, you know, especially if they're retired now, they rely on Social Security. But the fact is, is that I can get full benefits at what, 67? I'm 40. That's 27 years that I would have to wait in order to get full benefits. And that's if they don't increase the age to 70. And I look, look. <laughs> We don't factor in Social Security in none of our numbers. If we get it, that's a cherry on top. But everything that we are building for early retirement, having, you know, our main home, we would like that to, pay, to be paid off. So that way we don't, if we don't need $3 million, we're okay because our main home is paid off. So that will be paid off in about two years. My husband has a lot of stock within his company, so that'll be taken care of there. Um, and you know, we'll just have to worry about property taxes and all that, but we do have three rental properties. So we do get income every month from that, our side hustles and the, my books and things that I create. Um, and so, you know, it's really trying to find something when it comes to retirement planning that is so helpful. Um, one of the things that motivate me is not, is reading your comments. Number one, several of you are already retired. So you're giving like all of these gems, all of these tips and you know nuggets for us who are in the process of trying to get where you are um which i really do appreciate but that's why i like julie's channel about you know retire on monday uh, no, not retire happy on monday buzz retirement garage um that's another great one i love rob Berger as well our rich journey really like them because they are where we're trying to get to so every time they make videos about you know their journey and what they did and what not to do and what to think about i'm absorbing that information because i'm trying to or my husband and i we're trying to get there so every video you see me making of oh we bought this stock this week oh we you know we're, we're planning on buying this or you know you know we got to this share size goal all of that is so that we can get to our retirement number at the end of the day now our retirement number I said three million, right? <laughs> but I think we can do it on around two. But again, I'm trying to build an inflation into those numbers because, again, I'm 40, so we still have a you know two years things could change, and then that money has to last us. So you know, I think we're in a good place um, right now. But I thought that was a great question, like why, you know, the beefy number, um, and you know, why don't we plan on moving abroad? And we plan on traveling. Don't get me wrong. But home, like home base, is where we are now. Um, and so, yeah, I, I hope that answers your question. And you tell me down below, all of you watching, like, um, what is your retirement number? And do you plan on moving abroad? Like, do you, not traveling, but like, you know, relocating uh, abroad. Also, while I have you, thank you, everyone, for selling out the investment planner like I, I thought it would be you know it would resonate well with you guys because of all the hours and the editing and the work but man i did not expect you guys to not only sell out all of my current inventory but the second batch that i had for pre-order 
I only have like a few of those left. So thank you, thank you so much. You will start to see videos um, featuring those books and the spreadsheets. So again, I really, really do appreciate it. It's not too late for you to get yours. I have digital and physical. So you can check out my website, mt1finance.com. But um, yeah, all this investing and real estate and all of that is, is to get to retirement. Like it's to get to financial freedom. I would say even more so than retirement. Like, like, to do what we want, when we want it, how we want to do it, and not have to worry so much about how we're gonna pay for it. That's like what we're trying to, you know, get to. That's why we're making the sacrifices. That's why we're consistent. That's why you guys show up every time I post a video. That's why I'm making these videos, even if it's from the car and I'm freezing out here. You know, it's the consistency because it matters. Like, it's dollar cost average. And you'll be fine so again guys thank you so much for watching make sure you like share and subscribe smash the notification button so that you don't miss upload every time i post a video and leave me a comment down below again guys thank you so much for watching have a wonderful weekend and until next time you already know i'll see y'all in the next one bye bye